Raw is live from Montreal, Quebec, Canada, as we kick off the road to WrestleMania. And along with the title showdowns and Money in the Bank ladder match, we continue another big tradition. Some lucky superstar will try to break Undertaker's undefeated streak at WrestleMania. And this year, we're even holding a tournament to see who it'll be. Tonight is the first round with four determined superstars competing. We open the show with the first match of that tournament, Triple H against The Miz. Chris Jericho, what brings you to Raw? Not that it's any of your business, but consider me a talent scout. I know I'm gonna win SmackDown's tournament, and I wanted to see if anyone here on Raw would provide a challenge. So when you go out there tonight, know that the best in the world will be watching you closely. Don't crack under the pressure, okay? Are you in that tournament? I wouldn't get anywhere near Undertaker. I mean, didn't he encase Paul Bearer in cement? If Introducing first, from St. Louis, Missouri, weighing in at 245 pounds, Randy Orton. Gladiators step up to see who takes on the devil himself. If you ask me, the prize for winning this tournament is more like a punishment. Kofi. Oh! Orton's in trouble. Oh! Oh, wow. And Kofi delivers an amazing move. The neck isn't supposed to bend like that. Kofi squeezing down on the head. He hits the drop kick from an incredible vertical leap. He's got him. Orton's in trouble. A cover by Kingston. One. And Orton kicks out. <laughs> Orton's starting to feel the abuse he's taken so far. But we all Kingston. <laughs> oh. Kingston. With a cover now. One, two, three. Kofi did it. Kofi, what a performance. Another superstar advances. But he faces a tall task next week to see who will represent Raw. That's right. He'll face the game, Triple H. Everyone in WWE wants a shot at Undertaker, it seems. 
Well, only one person can break the streak, Michael. You're assuming a lot. What if nobody could do it? Good night, everybody. Boston is electric tonight as it hosts Monday Night Raw. And what a night we have for these great fans. The buzz of the WWE Universe is this Undertaker tournament. And Raw's second round will take place tonight. Each superstar is hungry to break Undertaker's vaunted WrestleMania streak. Who will move one step closer tonight? You won and I lost last week? Must have been a full moon or something. Something around here is full of... You don't have to worry about me, all right? I'm awesome, and that streak will never be broken. elite superstars are squaring off in tonight's main event. As unbreakable as Undertaker's streak seems, maybe one of these two could snap. He's in big trouble. What an impact from that kick. Kofi has the headlock. There's the incredible athleticism of Kofi Kingston. That could have broken a rim. This could be huge. A cover by Kingston. One. And the game kicks out. And a jaw-jacking punch. Kofi controlling the head. The game's in trouble. Triple H got his shot at Undertaker back at WrestleMania 17. What a war that was, King. He may be intent on breaking the arm. Countered by the game. And that punch lands hard. Kofi into the headlock. What an STO. He's got him hooked. Ooh. 
Kofi squeezing down on the head. He's in big trouble here. Pinned in the corner and eating Haymaker. Just a dominating display. Yeah, I think we could see a lot of punishment inflicted here. A cover by Kingston. One, two. Confused, Michael. When we determine Raw's winner, then what? From my understanding, he'll compete against the winners from ECW and SmackDown. I'd expect him to dodge one of these moves here and then use what brought him to the dance in order to finish this match off. Kofi has the arm. <laughs> ah, that kick's about as physical as they come. He's got him. <laughs> and there's the control frenzy. Kofi Kingston from out of nowhere. Oh, there it is! Well, it looks like he's really focusing in on that back. Kingston! What a crushing leg drop. Kingston! Trouble in paradise! We got a cover! One, One two, two, three! Three! Kofi wins. Kofi wins. Last week it was Randy Orton, and now Triple H has been turned away. He has beaten the best Raw has to offer in consecutive weeks. We might be witnessing the most determined man in the WWE Universe. I'm anxious to see who advances from ECW and SmackDown. As am I, partner. Is on the air live. We're here in New York City, and this crowd cannot wait to find out who Undertaker will face at WrestleMania. We have the winners from all three brands scheduled to compete in a triple threat match to determine the dead man's WrestleMania opponent. Vladimir Kozlov and Chris Jericho join Raw's qualifier. It's going to make a great main event. Those guys from SmackDown and ECW have better respect Raw's turf. Otherwise, they could find themselves in for a surprise. Know what I mean? What? Are you gonna make them sit next to you on the plane? You're a cruel guy, Miz. You make me sick. Yeah, bring a stupid boy. Introducing first, from Moscow, weighing 302 pounds, Vladimir Kozlov!
of West Africa, weighing 221 pounds, Kofi Kingston. These three men have made it to the top of the heap. Not quite the top, Michael. That spot is reserved for the dead man. That'll leave a mark. Kofi with the arm. Yeah. They hit the double team. Oh, ow! Kofi has the headlock. Jericho's in trouble. <laughs> the headbutt. Kofi controlling the waist. A suplex like that takes a lot of power and delivers a lot of impact. Kofi from behind. Oh man, what a Russian leg sweep. Ow, talk about meeting of the minds. Kofi controlling the head. Kofi controlling the arm. Jericho's in trouble. A sharp kick. The headbutt. What a shot Kofi just took. Oh, man. Kozlov. Another shot with the boot. He hits the Russian leg sweep. Would you look at that disgusting smirk on the face of Jericho? He's in big trouble. That'll do some damage. What's going on? Uh-oh. Undertaker. The Undertaker's in the ring. He's putting those educated feet to good use. And there's the controlled frenzy of Kingston. Jericho sure worked hard to get to this point, but it may have been in vain. He might be Undertaker. Ooh, that did it. Kofi, I'm confused. There wasn't a clear winner to this match. Sure looks to me like Undertaker came out on top. But he wasn't even supposed to be involved in the match. What's going to happen? I see a big meeting in the near future for the WWE Board of Directors. Hopefully, this will all be cleared up soon. Who's going to face the dead man at WrestleMania?